What was the, seriously, gift you opened this Christmas? Three bottles of wine. Every year for the past eight years I work into a conversation with this person that I don't drink. Usually at a dinner or party, can I get you a drink? Thank you. I'm good with water. I don't drink alcohol. Every year I get wine. I asked for some new tool for my hobby. Opened it. Happy. Next gift is apparently a companion open it same thing. My parents didn't understand what they bought so I got two custom sets of the same thing. It was funny but unfortunately not useful to have two of them. Cheese slicers. Didn't have any until now. For some reason my family thought it would be funny to get me five different ones. First gift I opened said it was from my mom. There was a small jewelry box which I opened to find four molars. My sister starts cracking up. They're her wisdom teeth LMAO. Her husband even found something with my mom's handwriting on it to make the tag believable. I got a really nice whiskey set from the mill. Four tumblers. Twelve bullet ice cubes. A decanter. And a high-priced bottle of whiskey. I don't drink. Cheap bath said I'm allergic to every year twice a year for 20 years. My brother gave me a bright orange wallet. Because you like orange so much. He said while flashing the wallet I gave him a few years ago. It's red. He's color blind. Whitening toothpaste. That's all I got. My husband knows I'm a huge health nut. So he had several gifts for me and one of them included this big 10 pounds bag of wheatgrass. He even put a red bow on it and everything. A Blu-ray movie we aren't equipped to watch. I got pants that are like 8 sizes too big from my dad. Again. The same thing 4 years in a row. Even though we have the size discussion every year and I buy the majority of my pants from there. Stores for like $4 because I destroy them at work anyway. Pensive face. Rub on tattoos. I have real tattoos. I got a positive one that made me say, seriously? In an excited way. My husband got me a ring with our kids' birthstones and it was so unexpected and touching. I also made a comment about the stocking thing going around about moms having empty stockings. He tries and puts a couple small things in. I mentioned it was such a fond memory having an overstuffed stocking with a couple small gifts and loads of candy. My stocking was comically stuffed this year with some items even having to sit beside it. Bless this man. My mill is very much a theme giver. My husband gets all things WVU because we're alumni. My son gets everything saxophone related because that is what he plays. My daughter gets gifts with cats be he likes cats. I have been dealing with breast cancer for the past year. My birthday and Mother's Day gifts were breast cancer related. I told to please not do that for Christmas. Well, she didn't listen. She got me a breast cancer awareness shirt. Christmas ornament. Because nothing screams Christmas like cancer. And a tabletop snowman decorating a Christmas tree with breast cancer ribbons. Woman face palming. I was polite and said thank you but inside I wanted to scream, are you kidding me? Single quote. I'm not sure if it is all going to goodwill or the trash. Recovering gambling addict here. Thankfully I managed to kick the habit before it totally ruined my life. This year I got a bunch of lottery scratch-off cards. Had my wife do the honors with them. And joke is on my family. They actually won a decent amount of money. Nothing life-changing but will definitely pay for some bills we knew were on the way. Yes. They knew about my addiction. They still have gotten me Texas Hold'em poker sets when those were in vogue. And other gambling related stuff over the years. Despite my continued insistence they not. And pointing out that some of these would be like giving a recovering alcoholic a gift card to the. Liquor store. 
Ah, the gift of not being heard. Bag of pretzels from Mill. Something they knew I'm allergic to. I keep getting kitchen appliances every year. Despite making it very well known I don't have a square inch of countertop space to spare in my kitchen. Recently was talking with my mom about how I've cut back pretty significantly on scented products of any kind for my health as I have allergies and asthma that has gotten worse. She got me scented shower steamers because she felt I must miss the fun scented stuff. Also, for some reason, there was an orange scented and mint scented steamer in the same box. Right next to each other. So when I opened the box it smelled awful. Individually they smell fine. Nothing. I got nothing for Christmas this year at all. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.